Imagine a massive star, several times larger than our sun, nearing the end of its life cycle. As the star exhausts its nuclear fuel, it can no longer resist the inward pull of gravity, causing it to collapse under its own immense weight. This collapse results in a mind-bogglingly dense object called a singularity, where all the mass of the star is concentrated into an infinitely small point. The gravitational force surrounding this singularity becomes so intense that it creates a region in space where escape is impossible. This region is what we call a black hole. Now, what makes black holes truly extraordinary is their event horizon. Picture a boundary around the singularity, beyond which anything that crosses it can never escape. This event horizon is like a point of no return, beyond which the gravitational pull is too strong for anything, including light to break free. To give you a sense of the incredible power of a black hole's gravity, let's consider the escape velocity. This is the minimum speed an object needs to overcome a celestial body's gravitational pull and break free. For Earth, the escape velocity is about 40,270 kilometers per hour, 25,020 miles per hour. However, near a black hole's event horizon, the escape velocity exceeds the speed of light, which is approximately 299,792 kilometers per second, 186,282 miles per second. This is why nothing, not even light, can escape its gravitational grasp. Let's dive deeper into the birth of Tun 618, a supermassive black hole that holds the title of being the largest known black hole in the universe. Its origins traced back billions of years ago to a remarkable event involving a colossal star. Picture a star many times more massive than our sun, shining brilliantly in the cosmos. Like all stars, this colossal star had a finite supply of nuclear fuel, which fueled its internal fusion reactions, creating immense energy. However, as time passed, this star began to exhaust its nuclear fuel reserves. As the nuclear reactions slowed down, the outward pressures generated by the fusion process weakened, unable to counterbalance the relentless inward pull of gravity. With no fuel left to maintain equilibrium, the colossal star's core started to collapse under its own gravitational force. The collapse intensified as the star's core became denser and denser. The immense weight led to an extraordinary compression, creating a singularity, a point of infinite density, at the heart of the collapsing star. This singularity became the seed from which Tun 618, a supermassive black hole, would grow. As the star's core collapsed, it released an enormous amount of energy in the form of a supernova explosion. This cataclysmic event ejected the outer layers of the star into space, while the core imploded, leaving behind the black hole. Tun 618's formation resulted from the remnants of this colossal star collapsing into a singularity surrounded by its event horizon. This supermassive black hole acquired its immense size through the accumulation of mass over billions of years, feeding on surrounding matter such as gas, dust, and even other stars that ventured too close. To put it simply, Tun 618 was born from the cataclysmic collapse of a colossal star, leaving behind an incredibly dense singularity and an event horizon that marks the boundary of its gravitational influence. It continues to grow in size by consuming matter from its galactic surroundings, becoming the colossal cosmic titan we marvel at today. Prepare to be astounded by the mind-boggling magnitude of Tun 618, the largest known black hole in the observable universe. Its mass is estimated to be an astonishing 66 billion times that of our sun. Let's try to grasp the enormity of this cosmic titan by using a simple analogy. Imagine our sun, a star of considerable size. Tun 618, on the other hand, is a colossal black hole that weighs 66 billion times more than our sun. To put it into perspective, Picture thousands of galaxies, each containing billions of stars, floating in space. Tun 618's immense mass is so overpowering that it could consume this staggering number of galaxies, swallowing them whole. Now, let's explore the technical details behind Tun 618's colossal mass. The mass of a black hole is determined by the amount of matter it has absorbed over time. As Tun 618 resides in the center of a galaxy, it has the advantage of drawing matter from its surroundings. The immense gravitational pull of Tun 618 captures nearby gas, dust, and stars, 
causing them to spiral inward and ultimately fall into the black hole's event horizon. This continuous process of accretion, where ton 618 steadily accumulates mass, has allowed it to grow to its astonishing size over billions of years. To calculate the mass of ton 618, astronomers use various methods, such as observing the motion of stars orbiting around it or studying the effects of its gravitational influence on its surrounding environment. Through meticulous calculations and sophisticated models, scientists have estimated its mass to be a staggering 66 billion times that of our sun. Ton 618's massive size has profound implications for the structure and dynamics of its host galaxy. Its gravitational influence shapes the distribution of stars, gas, and dust, influencing the evolution of the galaxy itself. The sheer magnitude of Ton 618 demonstrates the incredible power that supermassive black holes wield and their role in shaping the cosmos. Get ready to be amazed by the incredible power wielded by Ton 618, thanks to its massive size and gravitational pull. This colossal cosmic behemoth not only engulfs nearby matter, but also exerts a profound influence on its surrounding galactic environment. Ton 618's immense gravitational pull is so strong that it attracts nearby matter, including gas, dust, and even entire stars into its gravitational grasp. As these objects draw closer to the black hole, they experience intense tidal forces, a result of the significant difference in gravitational pull between the side of the object facing the black hole and the side facing away. The gravitational tidal forces caused by ton 618's immense mass distort the shape of nearby stars and even tear apart objects that venture too close. This process, known as tidal disruption, releases an enormous amount of energy as the disrupted matter spirals inward towards the black hole. As the matter falls into ton 618, it forms an accretion disk, a swirling disk of superheated gas and dust orbiting around the black hole. The intense gravitational forces and friction within this disk generate extreme temperatures, causing the matter to emit vast amounts of energy across the electromagnetic spectrum. The energy emitted from the accretion disk of ton 618 is astonishing, ranging from radio waves to x-rays and even gamma rays. This energetic output makes ton 618 18, one of the brightest objects in the universe, visible across vast cosmic distances. The immense power and energy released by Ton 618's accretion disk not only have an impact on the immediate vicinity but also shape the galactic environment around it. The energy and radiation from the black hole can influence the formation of new stars, trigger the collapse of gas clouds, and even disrupt the stability of the surrounding galaxy. Despite being located a staggering distance of approximately 10.4 billion light years away, Ton 618 continues to captivate astronomers and researchers. But how do we study something so distant and seemingly unreachable? One powerful tool in the astronomer's arsenal is spectroscopy. Spectroscopy allows scientists to analyze the light emitted or absorbed by celestial objects. By studying the spectrum of light from Ton 618, astronomers can decipher valuable information about its composition, temperature, and even its motion. To perform spectroscopy, astronomers use specialized instruments to disperse the light from Ton 618 into its constituent colors, much like a prism separating sunlight into a rainbow. By examining the unique pattern of colors, known as a spectrum, astronomers can identify the elements present, measure their abundances, and gain insights into the conditions surrounding the black hole. Another technique employed to study distant black holes like Ton 618 is gravitational lensing. Gravitational lensing occurs when the immense gravitational pull of a massive object, such as Ton 618, bends the path of light passing near it. This bending effect can act as a natural lens, magnifying and distorting the light from more distant objects behind it. By carefully observing the gravitational lensing effect caused by Ton 618, astronomers can gather information about the mass, shape, and distribution of matter in and around the black hole. This technique allows them to indirectly study Ton 618's properties and gain insights into the nature of supermassive black holes.
Additionally, astronomers employ computer simulations and models to study the behavior and evolution of black holes like TUN-618. These simulations use complex mathematical equations and algorithms to recreate the conditions and dynamics of these celestial giants. By comparing the outcomes of simulations with observational data, scientists can refine their understanding of black holes and uncover their mysteries. Through spectroscopy, gravitational lensing, and sophisticated computer models, astronomers piece together the puzzle of ton 618's nature and behavior despite its immense distance. These techniques allow us to explore the unseen, push the boundaries of our knowledge, and gain invaluable insights into the workings of the universe. The discovery of Tun 618 not only fascinates us with its colossal size and power, but also holds significant implications for our understanding of the universe. Scientists are intrigued by the relationship between supermassive black holes and the evolution of galaxies, seeking answers to how these cosmic giants shape the structures we observe. Tun 618 serves as a celestial doorway to unlocking these profound cosmic secrets. One of the key questions researchers explore is the correlation between the growth of supermassive black holes and the formation and evolution of galaxies. It is believed that as galaxies evolve and grow, their central regions develop supermassive black holes. These black holes then interact with their surrounding environment, influencing the galaxy's evolution in return. Tun 618, being the largest known black hole, provides a unique opportunity to study this relationship. By observing its impact on the surrounding galactic environment, scientists can gain insights into the intricate interplay between black hole growth and galaxy formation. One aspect of particular interest is how supermassive black holes regulate the growth of galaxies. The energy released during the accretion process, as matter falls into the black hole's gravitational grasp, can have a profound effect on the galaxy itself. This energy can heat or expel surrounding gas, impacting star formation rates and the availability of material for future generations of stars. Understanding these processes helps scientists paint a more comprehensive picture of galaxy evolution. Tun 618's colossal power and the influence it exerts on its galactic environment provide a valuable window into exploring these mechanisms. Furthermore, Tun 618 allows scientists to investigate the relationship between black hole activity and the formation of other cosmic structures. It is believed that the intense energy emitted by active supermassive black holes, like Tun 618, can influence the distribution of matter on even larger scales, such as galaxy clusters and superclusters. Studying Tun 618 and its impact on the cosmic web of structures helps us grasp the interconnected nature of the universe. By unraveling the mysteries surrounding these colossal black holes, scientists gain insights into the processes that have shaped the cosmos over billions of years. The universe never fails to astound us, and Tun 618 is a testament to its boundless wonders. Stay curious and keep exploring. If you found this journey through space captivating, remember to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more awe-inspiring cosmic revelations. Share your thoughts and suggestions in the comments below, and together, we'll continue unraveling the tapestry of the universe. Until next time, keep your eyes on the stars.